Hey guys, what's up? It's quarantine day like 19. I haven't been keeping track because it's just all the same, same thing every day pretty much. But um, I've gotten so bored to the point where I just want to see how many of these normal drinking glasses it's going to take <laughs> to fill up one of these uh, big Nalgene bottles. And they look about the same volume wise. But um, I feel like it's going to take a lot of these to fill up one of these. And I'm going to say it's going to be filled up once it reaches this mark. It's kind of hard to see because the camera's flipped. Well, this is uh, 32 ounces. So, um, yeah, let's get started. So, you can't see me. I'm off camera right now. But I'm filling up one of these, um, like, the small drinking glasses at my fridge. And I'm going to come over and I'm going to pour it into the Nalgene. And I guess we'll call this full. I hope I don't spill anything. Oh, God, I had a little bit of spillage there. All right. All right, so this is one. Uh, we're about a uh, fifth of the way there. Where's the sponge? I'll, I'll just clean it up later. All right, so that's one. We're around a 12-ounce mark. Oh, that's exactly 12 ounces. So I'm thinking like three of these is going to fill up one of these, so I'm guessing like three. There's two. And now I'm going back for three. All right, so we definitely went way over the mark, but so mystery solved. This is a completely pointless video. There was no like learning or science involved. There was like one little math thing, but mostly it's because I've gotten so bored over quarantine. And so yeah, it takes about three of these to fill up one of these. <laughs> this is so pointless. I don't even know why I did this. I guess for comedy. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. Wash your hands.